As is the norm at many functions, Uganda's celebrated midwife Esther Madudus starts with the nurses and midwives singing a nurses anthem. And as she crowns along with her face alight, her three-year-old son is holding onto her uniform, oblivious of the lyrics, meaning he seeks attention from a mother who sees more strangers than she does him. It is not long that this lady of the day slithers away from her child and walks with the entourage from the Minister of Health, our mentors from African Medical and Research Foundation, AMRIF, all here to honor her for her work that made her give up her child to her mother at just one year of age. Esther's child is just but getting only stolen moments with his mother, who is very busy taking the guests around this health center where she has made so much impact. He knows me as his mother. He doesn't call me now the, the nurse. Well, the nurse brand is what has made her the day's center of attraction. Is she doing something extreme that you're not doing? Actually, it is extreme because for us, we work within the health center, yeah. But for her, she goes out also to uh, advocate for mothers. Such selflessness made her be chosen to spearhead the Stand Up for African Mothers campaign by AMREF. This campaign will have far-reaching effects for Africa. Your vote could make her win the Nobel Peace Prize in 2015. But first things first, the Rio Award is now. This is given to uh, health workers, frontline health workers who have been committed to work uh, at uh, community. Health workers in Uganda should know that we do recognize their excellent work. Her family, friends, workmates and employers at the district level are witnesses. She has been very hardworking, she has been standing up every day for mothers. The Rio Awards was created by Save the Children and the Frontline Health Workers Coalition. Esther's has been given to her by AMREF in partnership with the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. But people who do what she does are still needed. Uganda has a shortage of about 2,000 midwives, but this is being addressed. AMREF is training 15,000 midwives in numerous African countries, including Uganda, Kenya and Tanzania. The Uganda Health System Strengthening Project under the Ministry of Health is training over 300, and Bela Uganda is to contribute too. Florence Alimba, NTV, Atiriri, Soroti District.